What's up, my folks? Back in the doghouse. I mean, this camera is not focusing what's shit. I'll be glad when I get another one. Bet y'all will too, huh? Why it does that so bad? There it goes. What's the matter, girl? What's the matter, Tink? You know, uh, here we go. We're gonna go back right over this bullshit again. All right, um, first of all, Mario, I gotta answer this guy, y'all, and I, I'm gonna make it public. And you guys that he's he's doing this shit too. Um, they said there's a few other you guys and, and the emails that he's messing with. Y'all contact me. It's time that we uh. You know, make a fist together, man. Uh, I talked to a couple attorneys a couple years ago about this. And there was a couple guys, and we touched on it, about getting uh, some attorneys on retainer. You know, you guys that are 100% solid. See, like me, I don't, I'm 100% solid. I don't do anything illegal. I don't fucking, I don't grow no pot. I don't make no liquor. I don't let no dogs fight. I ain't got no catch pin in my backyard. You know what I'm saying? I ain't shooting no deer at night selling no meat. Anything that they could have got me from, for when I was an outlaw, I don't have that. I ain't doing none of that. I don't do none of that no more for years. So, I mean, I'm solid. You know, the guy that's, that's stirring up this, I haven't, um, the dog, his dog breed that he, he raises, the man eaters, uh, they haven't been a fucking breed in America. I, I done retired from all that, the, what he's accusing me of before his dog was even recognized breed in America. You know what I'm saying? It's been longer than his dog was recognized. You know, you know, he's just, it, I don't know what this is about, but when it comes to a point where it's slander and deprivation of character, and, uh, you know, I'm sure there's other entities that's using, they're using these outlets. I told y'all in the beginning of these uh, videos that, that's what this is about, man. It's all about a war with us. You know, if anything, the pit bull people should be mad at them breeders. Y'all know it. The whole fraternity knows that 90% of them dogs that pit bulls get blamed for are bred for that kind of shit. Them kind of type of dogs. That little bulldoggy looking fucking man eaters. And our dogs get blamed for it. But yet they want to turn it on us. That's his, his argument that he can get blamed for something that someone else that pit bull owners do. Well, I mean, shit, we get blamed for shit that them type of dogs do all the time. You know what I'm saying? All the fucking time. It's a good turnaround, bud. I see you watch a lot of news and where you learn how to do that bullshit at. Been watching that sake bitch, ain't you? But, uh, you know, we need to stand together. And, uh, and it becomes a point where, you know, you get to the bottom of it and... The, the, you know, the guy that haven't learned anything about, always learn about dogs has all been on YouTube online. He's, you know, that's, every, everything he's learned about uh, dog fighting and dog fighters has been from, his, you know, I'm, a, I'm assuming he's learned all this shit from the Jessup lady and their little crew, uh, you know, so now he's coming after everybody else, you know. Well, that's fine and dandy, but when you start slandering people, and putting their dogs' lives at risk. You know they use this shit just like weapons of mass destruction. That's what they use. They'll use your videos, man, and come at us and put our dogs to sleep and put us in jail for nothing. Just because you've got an opinion you don't like no more that they pump your damn head up with. You see what I'm saying? You're falling right into that category. Now, you just claim to be a dog lover. Why you want to get that little puppy put down? Why you want to get him put down? You know what I'm saying? He ain't never done. Why do you want to get my dogs that all put down? They ain't never done another fucking thing to you. You know, think about what you're doing. This ain't a joke. You think this is a really a joke? You start getting people's dogs killed and see how funny it is. It's not going to be laughing matter. I'm telling you right now, it's not. And you think you're tough and all that shit all you want to, but I'm telling you, you get people arrested for no reason, their dogs killed for no fucking reason, you're going to find out what tough's about. I'm just saying, tough guy. Think about what you say about us. And you guys that he's doing this shit to, y'all get with me. And uh, to them attorneys, I I know Mr. Adam, I, I lost that contact info and that old phone that I had. Um, if you could contact me again, this would be something we could put back on the table. Because I know of at least 10 guys right now that would probably be interested in something like this. You know, it may be worth your time. Might cost us a little bit of money, but I, I think it'll be worth it. But um, anyway, guys, y'all take care and keep on bulldogging. And remember, if that's something that, that interests you, let's put it together. 
I mean, and if you know a good firm or you're an attorney, it's something you think that you could do. Um, and like I said, the guy's got to, you got to be bulletproof, no bullshit, no even little side shit they can use against you to come in and take the dog. You know what I'm saying? Any bullshit, you can't be fucking with it, you know. But uh, you solid, you know, I know that everybody's got to make a living and everyone's got to eat. And, and there's laws are different. Just, you know, you could get put in prison for growing pot and somewhere and then they grow it legally somewhere else. You see what I'm saying? So, but if y'all are all solid, you you know, let's, let's do that. I mean, that's just something we need to do because they're coming at the dogs all angles. Even now they even got breeders of other dogs attacking us. Y'all take care and keep on bulldogging.